not crying. I'm totally not crying. It's uh, the sweat gets all in my eyes. Um, welcome to the time treadmill. I'm Ron, and these are my sweaty thoughts about Doctor Who. Oh. A lot of great firsts in the Dalek invasion of Earth. I mean, first return of a recurring villain, first episode shot in an English quarry, first, first departure of a companion, and the first great Doctor Who monologue. You see, this story culminates with Susan falling in love with David and being conflicted she wants to stay, she wants to be with him, but she can't leave her grandfather, she can't leave the doctor. She says he's growing old and he needs her, but the doctor, he knows, he knows what's going on. And he leaves her behind, but not without giving a speech for the ages, saying goodbye to her and uttering these words. He says, one day I shall come back. Yes, I shall come back. Until then, there must be no regrets, no tears, no anxieties. Just go forward in all your beliefs and prove to me that I am not mistaken in mine. If there is truly a first great moment in Doctor Who, this is it. A stupid educational children's show that still manages to send off one of the original cast members in a truly great way, and, and I love it. Now, another key first to have to point out in this episode is that this is the first time that the Daleks actually say, exterminate. In the first Dalek story, they did use the word extermination, but it's not quite the same. This is the first time in the final episode as they're preparing to destroy the Earth's core and gut it to turn the Earth into a giant spaceship, a... Uh, star killer base if uh if you're star wars fans out there this weekend and as the daleks set their final plan in motion to detonate their bomb they're herding the humans down into the mine shafts and they issue the order to exterminate it's it's just it's a brilliant moment and there we are this this is why i'm doing this second lap to get to re-experience these this is a story that i could watch over and over and never have it get old and, and i'm just saying to you if you are not a doctor who fan you're a casual fan you're someone who's a fan of the new series maybe you love david tennant or matt smith and you're considering dipping into classic who i will tell you this one this is the one to dig up and watch dalek invasion of earth I love this story so much. Now that being said, tomorrow, tomorrow is my last story to watch before Christmas break. It's a two-parter, and it has absolutely my favorite line that Ian Chesterton ever says. So tune in tomorrow, and I'll tell you what that is. Mm -hmm.